I want to introduce you to one of the stars of the show in this video, which is this guy here. This is the Vapor Honing Technologies Vapor Blaster. This thing is incredible. As you know, I've been working on this little guy here, and all I've done is taken down that seam uh, with the belt grinder. Couldn't quite get all in here with the belt grinder. I've tried with other little like sanding tools and files and whatnot, but I couldn't quite get a good job of it. So I threw it in this cabinet, cleaned it right up, and as you can see, the, the finish just speaks for itself. It is incredible. You could just leave it like that and put it back on the bike. Uh, this is the VH800P. Uh, they have a whole bunch of different models from ones that sit on your bench to ones that you just throw something in, tie it down, and then it's automatic and you pull it out and it's done. So yeah, they pretty much, all you gotta do to use these machines is obviously open the door, throw your part in there that you're gonna use, uh, put your hands in the gloves just like you normally would, and start blasting. Uh, in the bottom of here, there is actually water and your abrasive and it makes a slurry obviously the pump is in the bottom and it mixes it up and pretty much pushes it outside this nozzle at whatever rate of psi that you have set so the other thing about this machine is that you can use it with rubber if you have like a carburetor with little rubber bits in it or an engine with rubber pieces on the side you don't have to worry about it destroying them like it would with a dry blast cabinet. Uh, purely because of the water, it just flows over it with the glass bead that you use. Yeah, it definitely uh, doesn't hurt rubbers, which is really good to know. The thing with this vapor blaster though is uh, the things that you don't notice, uh, like this little bit of brass that's inside there behind the spring, uh, I didn't even know that was there. It must have been covered in grime and dirt and just the things that you, you don't even see uh, that this machine can get to that you can't even, I mean, you'd spend like so long trying to scrub that up and you still probably wouldn't get it as good as that. Uh, all the brass pieces that you can see have just come up like magic, uh, like they're brand new. 